If you want to increase your distance on your drive, you'll have to learn how to increase your swing speed. In this week's golf tip, Mike Claybaugh shows us a simple drill to swing faster while still staying in control. So we're going to talk about increasing club head speed and one of the simplest ways to do it without having to invest any money at all. So we're going to start by putting five tees in the ground. We're going to go through this drill and each tee we're going to swing a little bit faster and we're going to get speed by the rotation of our body not our arms going faster. So the first tee is going to be nice and mellow. Each time make sure we're finishing unwound on our forward leg. Act like we're actually hitting a golf ball. Okay, the second tee a little bit faster. The speed is because my body is rotating faster, not because my arms are trying to swing harder. We don't want to feel like we're swinging harder with our arms because as a result, our arms will move out away from our body and we'll end up just pulling across the ball and resulting in a big slice. What we're going to find is when we finish, we've increased our club head speed gradually. What we want to do is not hit balls with one and two, the first two tees. We don't really want to hit with five either because we're on the verge of losing control. But that three and four is really a great way to swing at the ball and you'll find that your club head speed has increased. I usually increase my club speed by hitting a bad shot and then getting really angry at the ball yeah. and then just, you know, slicing it out of bounds once again. Yeah, the part where he was talking about you don't want to use your arms, to, that, that describes me I think he was good. talking right to and you And the there. whole slice thing, he's got it. I think I learned something today. That's good. Yeah, we'll try it the other way. If you enjoyed this segment of Lakeland News, please consider making a tax-deductible contribution to Lakeland PBS.